Hi everyone, it's Vanetta and I'm back to do another Melting My Stash review. I sorted through all of my empty containers and baggies and I have melted quite a few pineapple blends. So that's what I'm going to be focusing on in this video. A while back I did a video where I talked about pineapple blends, but in that same video I also talked about coconut blends. So it was a combination video, but this time around it's all about the pineapple. So I have um, empties here from vendors like Candles from the Keeping Room, BZ Tarts, Lasting Scent Candles, Dairy Air, and a few more. So I'm um, just going to get right into this. And I am going to start by talking about Pineapple Sage. This one was from Candles from the Keeping Room. And this was lovely. Such a beautiful scent. Very pure. Very authentic. Authentic. I recommend this one. Even if you don't think you like herbal blends, you know you don't like herbal blends, I mean, give this one a try. Maybe melt it in another room um, that, you know, where you would normally warm things and kind of let the scent flow into other areas. It's just so beautiful. The pineapple is a an authentic pineapple that is juicy. Um, it's ripe, it's fresh, and it has sweetness to it. But it also has those tart notes also, which is very nice. And you know you're getting an authentic pineapple. But what really made this beautiful, what made it sing, was the sage. And oh my goodness, it was just so good. I mean, the sage, those herbal notes just come through and it's very crisp. And it makes it a refreshing blend. It lightens it a bit. It's just so beautiful. I really recommend trying this one. Okay, moving right along, I'm going to talk about Pineapple Souffle. And this one is from BZ Tarts. And this is one of my favorite from BZ Tarts. I've ordered this one so many times and I have talked about it before. So I won't spend a lot of time, but I will say this is a very good scent. It's very strong. Um, it has a really good bakery note to it, along with a, a, a just a wonderful pineapple scent. Blending together creates this um, kind of a mouth-watering blend that's just kind of soothing. So I love this one. I always look for it whenever I'm ordering from BZ Tarts. It's just so, so good. And it covers a lot of area when it's melting, so sometimes you can smell it all around. Uh, this one is from Lasting Scent Candles, and this is Pineapple Pistachio Souffle. So this was um, one that I had to try. Um, one that is a slightly different because it has pistachio in it. Now I'm familiar with pineapple souffle, but adding that pistachio in there, I thought was an interesting idea. I like um, just the, the thought of it. And um, I love pistachio blends, so I had to, had to try this. Um, this was very good. Another mouth-watering blend. This is one that while I normally will not eat pineapple cakes, um, cakes with those pineapple fillings in them, unless it is um, just the cream filling, but if it has chunks of pineapple, I will not eat that type of dessert because I don't like that baked kind of soggy pineapple. That's how I think of it. But... Um, I will eat, you know, something that has more of a filling without that, those chunks of fruit. With this one, if it was an actual dessert and it had chunks of fruit, I would eat it. It smelled so good. The bakery note was so strong. It was just like kind of pulling me in. It was just, oh my gosh, it, it was so tempting. It was a really tempting scent. The souffle was perfect, creamy, rich. There was a little nuttiness to this but not a lot I didn't get a strong note of pistachio but I picked up on it and I thought it was nice I thought it was kind of interesting but what really stood out was that pineapple souffle more like a that pineapple cake scent and I think those smell wonderful I just can't bring myself to eating the ones with the chunks of fruit but anyway this is good I recommend trying it it works well in a tea light also in a 24 watt because I cut this in half. Good coverage when I melted them. Either way, perfect. Okay, 
Um, now I'm going to talk about another one from Lasting Sin Candles, and you can barely see that, but it says Pineapple Danish, and this was good also. Um, this was a nice scent that I thought was... Um, Maybe not over the top sweet like um, the pineapple pistachio souffle and some other sweet blends that I've melted from Lasting Scent Candles, but this was really good. Now it, it had sweetness, but it also had that bread to it, that dough. And so I think that toned it down a little bit. I enjoyed this one a lot. I melted this one one morning and it was just like, okay, I'm hungry now. I need some breakfast. I need something, some sort of a treat or something. So this was very good. I recommend trying this one as well. This one melt, um, performed well in a 24 watt warmer. So I was very happy with it. I would get it again. Okay, now I'm going to talk about pineapple orchid. And I have two of them. The first one is from BZ Tarts. And this one I reviewed already. I'm trying to read my handwriting and that says reviewed. So just really quickly, um, the reason why I wanted to add this one to this particular video is because um, I wanted to do a little comparison because I also have it from Candles from the Keeping Room. and. Um, I know most of you have seen this, but look how cute. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. <laughs> so anyway, very similar. Very similar on the cold sniff. Almost the same. Exactly the same, in fact. But when they melt, I picked up on something a little bit different. So... In the pineapple orchid from Candles from the Keeping Room is very strong. It's very strong on the cold sniff, so you know when it's melting in that 24 watt warmer, it's going to be strong. Um, and I loved it. I loved every single moment of it. Um, I felt like I got both the pineapple and the orchid, but that pineapple stood out just slightly more for me than in this one. In this one, pineapple orchid from BZ Tarts. I got both the pineapple and the orchid. It was very strong. It covered a lot of space. I felt like I was getting a little bit more of the orchid notes. Now that, that opinion would vary from person to person depending on, you know, your nose. But that's what I picked up on. And I thought these were both lovely. I will continue to order this scent. I think it's a great scent. Perfect for any time of the year so good and I'm down to the last one so I have to melt this at the right moment <laughs> okay so I've gotten through those now I'm going to talk about what I melted from Dairy Air Crafts and Gifts now this first one is Pink Sangria Honeydew Melon Pineapple Smoothie and I'll say right off the bat I got all I, I could smell everything in this one and I liked it I liked the the blend this, the pink sangria was there, and um, it was a nice mellow sangria scent. That honeydew melon really stood out. Like, it stood out front and center. It was very good. I really liked it. The pineapple smoothie added that creaminess, added a sweetness, and the, the pineapple note was in there. So it blended very well. I think this was a really good scent combination. One that I'm pretty sure I would not have thought of. I would think to put honeydew melon pineapple smoothie together but probably would not have put that pink sangria in there however I like this blend so I'm glad that I got to try that now this one this is banana cream pie fresh squeezed pineapple and vanilla smoothie I did not like this blend there was something off about it in my opinion I don't think these notes worked well together um, and I am someone who loves banana scents, and I also enjoy pineapple scents, but, um, I don't know, this did not work for me. Um, yeah, but, you know, someone else might like it. If you like, uh, these, uh, blends, the banana, the pineapple, and the vanilla smoothie, it might work for you, but I don't know why. It just, I felt like I needed to turn it off, which I did. I actually poured it out and melted something else okay then I have one here 
from L3 and this is mango sorbet pineapple pomegranate this was really good the mango note was the strongest note in this one but the pineapple does come through pomegranate is a lighter blend in this and it really didn't have presence in this one I wasn't impressed with the pomegranate but I love the mango and the pineapple and I thought that was pretty interesting it was kind of a light airy scent but very good the notes came through I melted this one in a 24 watt warmer uh, and I also melted uh, a bit of it in a 17 watt warmer and I got a very good throw okay let's see what else ah this one this is from up the creek scents and this is pineapple confetti cake oh my goodness okay so I melted this one a few different times because there were four tarts in here I melted it once in a um, 20 the first time I melted it I melted it in a 25 watt warmer and, and this was in my living room and you know I got the scent but I felt that it was light another time that I melted it I went ahead and put it in my um, in my tea light burner and oh my goodness the scent was amazing I could smell it like all over the area that I was melting it in beautiful really strong smells like a cake um, with a creamy some sort of um, like a, a pineapple smoothie type of scent with a bakery added to it. That's what I got from it. I thought it was so good. Um, then I went ahead and I melted it in a 20 watt warmer. And that was okay. It wasn't the best. I really liked it in a 24 watt. And in the tea light burner was the best. Because the tea light burner, the scent was so intense. It was incredible. And I have one more, and this one is from Waxy Lady, and this is Coconut Mandarin Pineapple. This one was okay. I found it to be light. However, I got all of the notes. I could smell the coconut, I could smell the mandarin, and I could smell the pineapple. And I thought the pineapple and the mandarin were perfect together. Um, another scent blend that I think, wow, that's, that's something nice. That's something that I would like to melt more of the the coconut was light for me didn't really have a whole lot of coconut all around throughout the entire time that it was melting but what really stood out was the mandarin and the pineapple and I thought it was just lovely little light I would like it stronger but I like the blend okay everyone so those are the pineapple blends that I melted uh, from these vendors and I will be back with a few more Melting My Stash reviews soon. Okay, take care, everyone. Bye-bye.